I actually thought that I've seen all different sporting variations within the years that I've been playing VR. It would appear that I have not, and Spinboard has spun me through a hoop, even though this game doesn't really have anything to do with hoops. So hit them like and subscribe and let's uh, get into it. So what is Spinball? Well, that's kind of easy and kind of hard to explain. If you like games like table tennis, tennis, and the closest one that I can think of is squash. Huh? But basically what you're doing is you're taking your ball, you're serving, you're hitting it onto a little trampoline, it then bounces onto the walls, and then it's your opponent's turn to try and hit it back onto the trampoline. And then this goes back and forward until someone fumbles and it either goes over the arena walls or it hits the ground and therefore you no! lose a point. A quick disclaimer, you do need a little bit of room to play this unless you just try to like stay on one side of the actual arena itself. I living in Britain, our houses aren't that big, so I did have a little bit of a problem with this, but I still had enough space to do something with it. In single player, as you can imagine, you're put against a bot and basically there's different levels ranging from easy to god. And I would say I did actually have some fun with this, that's where I actually started liking this game that there are cosmetics that you can collect and unlock during the game that you can put on and change your racket and things like that. The, the normal things that you can do. If you're new to this sort of game, there are tutorials. There's also places that you can go and practice where it even teaches you in different core elements of the actual gameplay, you know, like accuracy and all that lot. Spinball is a fun game to play and I'm guessing if the dev team keep on adding to it and bringing new things to the table then it could be around for quite a while and a very enjoyable while that would be. The controls worked really well, I didn't have any issues. It being in MR or mixed reality straight off the bat, pardon the pun, was just excellent for me because I love mixed reality things as you already know. The gameplay can go at your own pace, you can either go slow and steady or you do have those frantic games where it's just flying all over the place and it's a mad dash to see who can get the point off the other player. This is a classic case of really simple to look at and to sort of like play but really difficult to master. Almost kind of like a proper sport, if you like. Excellent. As for an exercise game, I think it would probably be quite decent for that as well, as you do have to move around and you're not just positioned in one place all the time. And you do need to sort of like flare your arms around to hit the ball as well. I'm guessing also quite good for the eye-hand coordination. Graphically, yeah, it's pretty decent as well. There's nothing really outstanding, but it's a racket ball game. I mean, I don't know what everyone expects. There are like nice little designs of the balls, nice little designs of masks and things like that. I think they're pretty cool. Sound wise, that was pretty decent as well. The music was pretty decent. It was all right to play the game to. I didn't actually turn it down much and it was fun to listen to in the background. All in all, if you like racket games and you're looking for something to either exercise with or play online or indeed just play offline just for a little bit of exercise here and there, I think Spinball could be for you. If you're looking for a multiplayer experience, again this sort of thing lives and dies by the community, but it seems to have quite a decent community at the moment. Of course it's only just come out so you may have to wait a little bit here and there and of course the community will just hopefully keep growing as well as the devs building on the bricks that they've already just laid. So for me, I will be playing this again and I'm probably having fun as well. So do let me know down in the comments whether you'll be picking this one up and also are you into this sort of racket based type gameplay? 